So today's video, I'll be showing you guys how much I spend in a week as a 20 year old living in San Francisco under their parents' roof. So I was born and raised in San Francisco and I moved out in August last year for college and I'm currently in the 626 right now but I go to school in OC and I went back home for three weeks during June and I'm just going to show you guys how much I spend in a week. I have to say that this week was more of like a calmer week because the first week I was back, um, some of my friends came up from SoCal and I showed them around so a lot of like touristy things. We ate out a lot spent a lot of money so the second week it was more chill i was working at the ritzia in downtown sf because i transferred stores for two weeks so i was like adjusting and i didn't have plans with friends because i just didn't make any and the next week which was the, my last week in sf i spent a lot more because i was hanging out with friends third week was the last week i was going to be home for the summer and i'm not going back until i don't know when because i'm staying here until school starts yeah so that's what today's video is if you guys are new to my channel make sure to subscribe and follow me on social media i recently added my tiktok on here and also follow me on depop because i'll be selling a lot of my clothes and yeah i'm gonna show you guys how much i spend in a week my prediction would be like i feel like i spent under 500 that's my prediction so let it go all the puts are like whoa thing i go cause you don't i see i see i got a better now girl yeah got your cold blood yeah no i is it that i swear so I got my boba and I'm going home. Currently driving home from work and I already spent money today. So I spent $15 on parking. So I just ate dinner with my family at home and I'm heading out. It's currently 9. I'm going to go get dessert with my friend. Place closes at 10. It's already 9. Yeah. I've been just picking up, 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 I had plans today, but then they flopped, and now I'm just gonna do whatever and just go run air. I'm gonna go to Sarah Monte. I'm gonna go there to buy some things because I left most, like pretty much everything in my apartment down in SoCal because I thought I was gonna be here for two weeks and now I need stuff. So I'm gonna run errands, maybe do some shopping because there are some stores that I wanna look at. And then we're also gonna get food because I haven't eaten all day. And I'm bringing my brother with me because we haven't hung out in a long time because I've been away at college. So I'm just gonna bring you guys along and I'm wearing this hoodie that I wore yesterday. And then these sweatpants from my middle school. and I found this like really cute kind of corset-ish top and then I also found these shorts because it's like summer and I'll be going back to Silk House and I don't have shorts home and i bought some things today at the mall so i went to hollister i tried on those two things that i found but i didn't like any of them as i was walking out of the store on a top that i liked so i just got this like white tank top the tank top was 10.99 and then last place we went to was target i got the micellar water i used this to wipe off my makeup and to wash my extensions and then i also got these like teeth floss picks um because i left all of mine in socal so i think the total from there was like 14 something i have to check my credit card later and then we went to in and out so i got two burgers with grilled onions my brother got two also and then we got animal fries the total came out to be 2302 so i think that's all i'm going to spend money on today unless i do some online shopping i'm not going to go out today because i already found a parking spot in my neighborhood for those of you guys who don't know parking in, in sf is like terrible because there's literally no parking anywhere On um, mistake three, I don't think I have plans today on going out, but I'm doing some online shopping because I most of my wardrobe or my clothes is back in my SoCal apartment and I'm home for another week and I need clothes for work because I can't be wearing the same pants like every day. Um, and I've been wanting these pants for a while, so I'm going to get them. So they're the Dickies pants, um, so like the 
famous like TikTok pants. I got these in September in a khaki color but I gave them to someone else. And then I saw this new TikTok about these like scrubs and I was gonna get them in white but I feel like that was too much of a hassle to like wear the right underwear for it so I'm gonna get green. And since I'm already doing some online shopping I probably will just shop a little bit more later um, but the total for this is going to be 5102 my breakfast and it's probably from one of the best dim sum takeouts in SF. I wouldn't say there's good Chinese food in SF but this place is like really good. My mom also went to the bakery in Chinatown and got me my favorite so this is like the corn and ham like I forgot what, like mayo pastry and then the pineapple buns here are so good. Now I'm in my car and I have to go get an oil change for my car because it's about to hit 42,000 miles. I'm going to my friend's dad's auto shop so it's 13 minutes away. It's near like Soma. Get there, drop my car off and then take the bus to work and I've just parked my car and I have 30 minutes to kill before my shift starts so I'm gonna do a little shopping around so I think I'm gonna go to Nike and if I still have time I'm gonna get Jamba Juice or Boba I'm still debating the time I'm gonna Nike because the elevator took like five minutes um, walking to work it's 1140 I'm packing by the cable cars I can't believe I'm vlogging in public and to work here's the fit new fitting room fit not gonna really vlog much today because i just can't just like whip this out $15 i'm parking which means that's been $30 this week so far and i work two more times this week and next week i work three times so that's all gonna add up um I was gonna buy something today at work, but then I got too lazy. I'll tell you, stop trying. Yeah, yeah, you got me. Let it go. I would all put some like, whoa, thing on gold. I'll shake over. I see, I see, I see. I got a bit of love, yo. Just got off work and I'm starving, so I'm gonna try town. My best friend came to visit me at work and I haven't seen her since November and she just came back home from Riverside yesterday and now I'm gonna go get food because I haven't eaten since 9 and it's 3.30. Um, I was gonna take a 10 minute break but I feel like those are just useless so I might as well just like power through the entire shift. Um, so now I'm gonna exit if I can figure it out. Currently in Chinatown with my mom and she's grocery shopping and then I got my food that I'm gonna eat. Now it's gonna be like a snack at like five. And then I'm gonna get boba. So I might drink because I'm really dehydrated and I don't want to drink water. So I baited my mom and she came with me and so she paid for everything so perks of living at home. Oh, and I really like my hair right now. It's like wavy but it's like because it's messy. So I got my food. I got this at Little Paris in Chinatown and this is one of my favorite like quick eats like takeout spots as well as like flow spots. So it's called Little Paris. It's on Stockton and Jackson I think. So I got this like Vietnamese ham with the um, rice noodles. It's like flat rice noodles. I don't, I don't know how to call it, but it's seven dollars, and it used to be five dollars before the pandemic, and then during the quarantine it was five fifty, and then last summer it was six. Closing down soon is what I heard, and I just every time I come back from college I have to visit. I eat this when I get home. Then we went to Yifeng, so I got mango sago. I've never gotten this drink from there, but the person in front of me got it. But it was like seven dollars, and I don't know why this boba is so expensive. But I guess I don't even think it's that good. And it's super small. This is a medium. My mom paid for everything. She got a brown sugar pearl uji latte. 
and the total was 425 for both of our drinks and I didn't pay for any because I'm with my mom so that's the perk of living at home and being back at home and living in the city because I don't know why it's so expensive here and I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna drink this along the way because it's gonna be traffic because it's rush hour